Okay, so we're on reel two now of the transfer of the Rockin' All Over the World album. Um, we put reel three in to be baked earlier on. And um, I'm just going to give the heads a quick clean. Um, it, it's um, just a matter of purely a precaution. They were done earlier in the day, but I just want to give them another once over. And my, my daughter Sophie, who is here with me... Um, as the camera operator and director of this particular segment uh, was just asking me, um, as a youth in the digital world, um, what these all were. And so I just thought I'd explain that this first head that we're looking at here is the erase head. And this basically, when the machine goes in record, wipes anything that's, that's on that particular track that's, uh, that's energized. Then the second head is the um, record um, cell sync head and the third is the reproduce head and then so we're, we're not using obviously either of these two heads right now but the third head this repro head here is the one that we're we're actually pulling everything off off the tape um, so that's all ready to go and I've just got to lace it into the loop and into the photo cell which energizes everything up and this is uh, this first song on this reel is uh, "Who Am I?" That was a song that Pip, Pip Williams and Peter Hutchins wrote, and um, so that's the first track that we're going to put across today. Hi everyone, uh, we're back to it again. Uh, we just transferred uh, "Rockers Rolling," and that went across brilliantly, no problems at all. And we're coming up to the whole pinnacle of what provided the title track for the album and for the tour and everything else that went with it and has gone with it ever since. Uh, so this is the moment that we take out of the box, put on the machine after 34 years, rocking all over the world. Okay, well that's, that's it. End of reel two and rocking all over the world, uh, safely across and now digitized. And re remarkable, I mean, we had, uh, I was just going through and counting the edits. We had four edits on that track. Uh, it was the main body of, everything was like one one take, one solid take until after the solo. And then uh, on that verse coming in out, the solo was, the, we, was our like, first splice we put in. And then it was solid then up until... Um, the I like it repeats where John does a tom build, big tom build, and we had another bar that we put in there at that point, and then then out of that it was another section that ran up until um, just before Pip comes in with that high slide part that we put on, that was that the very well it was the last pretty much I think the last thing we did before we mixed it at Threshold that little very late night we started incredibly late I think we've been doing du final dubs most of the day and then we'd started to do the mix um, mix pretty late at night and we ran all through the night the um, we were really under the gun then I think to, to deliver this single to phonogram at the point so anyway that's that's it that's a little bit of the history of uh, of rocking all over the world in the transfer now and so we're we're in uh, we're in great shape and I'm going to have a cup of tea and then move on to rule 3